Hi, my name is Aubrey Kate, and today I have my best friend Taylor with me, and we are making a what's in my porn bag video. So he's going to go through my bag, pick something out, and I'm going to explain why it's important and why I need it. So much fun stuff in here. <laughs> Cute. Okay. So, I guess we'll start with some of your favorite products for like beauty, I guess. So... This is a classic. I've heard all about this, but I haven't used it before. I know, it's so my you gotta favorite. tell me. So this is the Sally Hansen Leg Spray. So I don't really like to tan in beds anymore, just because I feel like a lot of my family has skin cancer, and it's really bad for you. That's true. So I like to spray tan, and sometimes it gets kind of uneven. And this is amazing. It's like liquid makeup. So you just spray it on your legs, and your legs look like a perfect pair of pantyhose without wearing pantyhose. So it's more like red carpet. Uh, yeah, definitely like red carpet. Yeah, Not an everyday for sure, because yeah. it kind of gets on your clothes. But yeah, for sure. For photo shoots, if you're, when you're naked, like, bomb. I've heard that. I feel like Kylie Jenner's talked about that before. Yeah. The Sally Hansen, yeah, it's like cult following. Yeah. Um, so next up, let's go for this. So what do you... Alright, so this is a robe. <clears throat> um, when you're filming, you're like naked, you're doing pictures, and then video, and you're going everywhere, and okay. sometimes you're just like... This is in, so drama. You're in random houses with windows, you know, so you don't want people to see you naked, and sometimes there's a lot of people on set with PAs and all these extra people, and so, cool. you know, when you're naked, you don't want to, like, yeah, keep like getting dressed. Yeah, when you're laundering, yeah, for sure. Right, so it's just easy to have a robe with That you. makes sense why you would have that, yeah. actually. Yeah. Go for something fun. Uh -huh. <laughs> there's so much random shit in here. <laughs> what, what the fuck do you do? <laughs> so I just picked a toy. Like it could be any dildo, but um, this can be for like multiple reasons. Some can be really graphic and pretty gross. But it's pretty graphic. Um, I mean, it's like a unicorn spike. <laughs> <laughs> so this is just like when you're preparing for an anal scene, you're just trying to like stretch open a little bit. So I always like to have a toy with me to just keep myself a little open so it's not like sense, painful. Yeah. It totally makes also, sense. Also, like when you're cleaning out, so you know, like if you actually use an enema and then use a toy up there, it kind of like pulls everything yeah, out. Yeah, so that makes sense. So it's kind of like a two-in-one. A two-in-one. Two-in-one special, honey. Yeah. Okay, so we've got two kinds of wipes here, so let's talk about these. Two wipes. <clears throat> so, these are makeup wipes. So I kind of sometimes use this before my makeup just to clean or cleanse my face. Um, and then when I'm done filming, you know, I'm not going to leave the house yeah. with full on porn makeup with probably cum on my face. So makeup wipes. For the win, for the win. And then these are baby wipes. So every time I'm douching or yeah, you wipe wiping, I don't want to use sense. anything dry because then it just dries it out and chase. And speaking of so, douche. Baby wipes. Also got that. We all An know what enema. that's for. So we don't for you guys that have never used a douche that. before, you don't use the actual solution in there. You want to dump it out, rinse it out, and use water. Because if you use this, you're going to be pooping for days. True. And... I don't do porn, but I even know that, so... But this <laughs> is to clean it out. So this just makes sure... It's like a temporary bulb. Yeah, this is just More like so. a disposable. <laughs> so disposable the bulb. solution in this, <laughs> it's uh, actually made for people that are constipated or they can't go to the bathroom. So if you use this, it's just going to keep making you go and go. So you want to dump this out and use water so it doesn't make you keep going. It just kind of cleanses and get everything out and preps you for anal. So totally makes sense. Definitely your best friend on a set day. Come through fleet. Um, we'll go back to makeup. I mean, that's what you got in here, yeah? Yeah, makeup bag. <clears throat> makeup bag is always fun. So, um, part. when I'm filming, I normally have my hair and makeup done by a makeup artist. So they normally have everything. Um, but some makeup artists, they're not really like prepared they're not prepared it's happened one and two a lot of them do mainstream and they've never done porn makeup so i always bring a foundation <clears throat> and double wear is like my go-to it's like full yeah. face waterproof cum proof i get that double wear does look good on film you know definitely not every day yeah on film it looks great every day you might look a little cake but, but i get that i love bomb. Double too. my go-to um, I bring a beauty blender because the makeup artist sometimes leaves, so I just like to touch up with my beauty blender. And then when I leave and I wash my face, I don't want to leave without anything 
Ooh, drink. <laughs> yeah. Thanks to the best Thank boyfriend you. ever. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what? Best one? boyfriend. I have made one. I don't get a kiss. <laughs> We're busy, baby. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Oh, that's good. So this is just like a tinted moisturizer. So after my scene, and I'm done filming, I don't want to leave like all red face from yeah, for everything. Sure. So I just have like a tinted you need moisturizer on, right? before you like leaving sweat. <laughs> right. <laughs> And then powder, very important because when the makeup artist leaves and you're oily and you need to touch up, I like to have my own powder. Sometimes I don't like to leave that. Yeah, you gotta set it with something. And last thing in my makeup bag is just like a tinted lip balm because they put on so much different kind of lip products. It's usually those matte ones too, so they don't transfer, right? And it's and very matte. So drying. Very so drying. drying. So this just makes your yeah. lips not so dry. And also this was in my makeup bag but fell out. Um, it's a lip gloss because sometimes it's matte. And you it gotta looks... set it, right? A little shine. Yeah, it's just a little bit of shimmer. It happens, babe. So, I guess we're on to body products. I mean, you've got like this Dove Winter Care. Obviously, right. we all know what this is. But... Right. I mean, everybody knows what this is, but not every time you go on set do they you think have? to bring it, yeah, for sure. Right, and yeah. it's just like you're filming with some random person. You and sets like, are long shower. too, yeah. Like you're people on don't set, realize like... they're like on there for six to twelve, even yeah. longer. I've seen people go on there for. And like... you have to split up sessions, so it's like if you yeah. get like hot and sweaty and like lubed up in one, you want to like refresh right. and before I, the and next. Right, and I'm like known for doing yeah. two, three scenes in the same day, so it's just like yeah. I'm not trying to like have my scene partner on. Yeah. For my next one, that's for sure. Gross, so. I would get that for sure. So I bring that. Oh, I don't really bring yeah. shampoo and conditioner, and that's I guess the next one. Well, yeah, you're not gonna redo your hair. I'm not gonna redo my hair. So a shower cap is important, so you can shower Protect and not it. get your hair wet. Yeah. Shaving cream kind of goes with the bath category, I guess, huh? Right. So touching so, up. Just touching up. I mean, I always shave, but I mean sometimes you miss little spots. And so I just like to have it just in case. So does shaving like matter with a scene partner though? Do they get like? I mean, on that? no, yeah. I'm not saying that, but I mean sometimes like the camera and fucking can 4K, see everything. Right? Can see like, everything. Yeah, and I'm, every I'm like, spot. you know, sometimes that happens. Like my butthole, I'm just like, oh fuck, I forgot. <laughs> a little patch right there. Yeah, you know, like how many times you shave your butthole? That's hella funny. That's hella funny. But yeah, just in case. So why two toothbrushes? Um, so these are two different things. Oh, so, this is a, a tongue scrubber. A tongue scrubber. Okay, got you. Right. So I mean, you're like kissing people and like making out with them. So it's just like you want to have fresh breath. Fresh, yeah, for sure. Okay, this one's kind of fun. <laughs> so we have Preparation H, which I've watched the commercials, but I don't know why the fuck you would bring this for porn. So, I mean, doing transsexual porn, it's all anal. Yeah, for sure. So, I mean, I just like to shove that shit up there and kick that shit on just to prevent and just, like, keep everything going in there. Calm down kind of you thing, know? yeah. Like, I mean, I was filming at least once a week. Mm. So, I mean, and it's, like, rough, hardcore, intense sex. I so, imagine, doing that yeah. and then... Especially when you're doing like multiple scenes in a day, like that's right. a good like preventative, right? Like and just to kind of like keep everything calm down there, like, yeah, like gang bangs and double yeah. anal and doing the crazy shit. You definitely need for sure. Yeah. So next up, we have this bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> so, so we'll is, go ahead and show that. So this off. is a butt plug. I mean, I have different sides. This is definitely not my go-to butt plug. <laughs> <laughs> you take that every day. Come on. Uh, I mean, okay. <laughs> But no, so this is actually from a stretch kit, so it came from like a little tiny size all the way up. There's actually one bigger than this, but it goes Shit. up to here. Um, but <laughs> like doing double anal that. and trying to do triple anal, you definitely want to like prepare for that. You don't want to just like... Yeah, like throw it up there, like you'll die. I mean, I did that for my double anal. It totally makes sense because you want to look like cute, right? Whenever you're... Right. You don't want to be like, ah! You don't want to start the scene by being like, oh! <laughs> Right. So, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. I guess just preparing, and I actually sometimes just use this, like, the night before. Yeah. You know? So it, like, saves you, you know? So you're not, like, miserable the whole day, right? Exactly. You don't want to be fucking miserable. So we'll go into the Pedialyte. Okay. Yeah. So Pedialyte. Love this shit. I'm obsessed. 
I'm obsessed. I'm so obsessed. Save I your life. I have to do this because this, this is my meal for like the day before anal, the day of anal. Yeah, just those two days. Because yeah. after my anal scene, I'm fucking like, let's go fucking eat. Yeah, but I need some sugar. Like, like the day before, like this is basically gives you energy and it just like keeps you full and it gives you like. Everything's so not dehydrated and keeps you up. It's just like a Red Bull, but like healthy. Yeah, no, for sure. Like especially when you have a hangover or anything, those come in great. But right, and it keeps you hydrated. Like, you're, so like, like when I do all those, all when I do all those spitting scenes, and I'm like all like ah, yeah, and like I know. my cum bubbles. Cotton mouth is the worst, huh? Like this keeps your mouth wet, and then gummy bears are like anal friendly, so they don't like make you poop. So yeah. You know, like it just. Well, and these are good for your blood sugar. They too, don't even yeah? come out for. We're poop. not diabetics yet, but. Love right. gummy bears. Yeah, so these are ice cream cream. So, eat. speaking of cotton mouth, I guess. Yeah, so I mean, Next as y'all know, I'm a big stoner. And it's just like when you're filming, you can't really like run out and like light a bowl or fucking have a bong or smoke a joint. So, I like to have a little vape pen. Yeah, easy on the go. I could see that, for sure. I bring those to work with me, so. It's blueberry, you should try it. She's nice. She's nice, honey. Yeah. What else? So, I mean, that's pretty much it. I mean, you've got, like, some other things in here. Like, obviously, we have a brush. You want to, like, touch up your fucking hair, right? Right, just like, touch up, body spray. You obviously want to smell good. Something that's super important is lotion. Especially for girls, like when you're doing your pretty girls, you don't want to be like ashy. And yeah, you're spray right? Tanning. Those knees all ashy. Come on. So you definitely want to have lotion. Touch up. Um, sometimes on set they don't have water or anything, so I like to have my own water. I have Pedialyte, but water is water. I don't drink tap water. So I always bring my bottled Makes water. Sense. Um, just like a travel first aid kit. I've definitely been cut on set or stubbed my toe, and I always have like a neosporin or band-aids just whatever's in it normal yeah um a hair clip you know when you're getting your makeup done or when you're like it's hot on set i just like to have a hair clip comes in handy for sure a same with q-tips yeah, comes in handy q-tips my for? under eye gets really bad so i like to touch oh, up when you're like sweating and stuff mm -hmm. yeah that makes sense especially when you just had your makeup done right totally makes phone sense. charger my phone always dies i'm on set forever deodorant can't go wrong. Best selling deodorant right here. It's my favorite. It smells so good, honestly. I'm surprised you had this, honestly. I didn't know you wore this one. She's nice. Ah! I was like, did you just make me smell my armpit? Yeah, <laughs> basically. She's nice. Though. Um, This is an important one, too. It's Imodium. Um, I personally don't use this anymore, but I wanted this in my bag. Um, It just makes you like, it's like anti diarrhea. So. You don't poop on your partner. I don't poop on my partners, but I don't Probably use this anymore. It's a good preventative, though. It's a good preventative. I don't use it anymore because I have really bad stomach issues, and so I actually have been hospitalized for using this because I couldn't go to the bathroom for like two weeks. But oh my god, I used to use this. It's hardcore. This is the liquid one that you gave me that one time, huh? Yeah. This is nasty. And then, last but not least, I bring my own lube. Um, gun oil is like my go-to. It's my favorite. I love silicone. Um, a lot of filming places have lube, but they have coconut oil or water-based or whatever brand they have. This is something that I've used since I started anal, so it's just my go-to. That's cool. But I think that is basically everything that I bring. Um, other than that, on I would day. bring, like, three outfits. Um, on the day of the shoot, they normally text you, like, what type of scene it is and they will either a provide the wardrobe for you or they'll tell you to bring certain looks so i would also put in three pairs of heels three pairs of lingerie and three pairs of outfits and then i let them choose yeah you like options so, right? i like to have options for sure i didn't put that in my bag because it's just like it's all different but i usually put three three and three yeah the last thing everybody forgets a phone charger so you I think guys... we talked about that drunk ass. Did we? Why is it in here, man? Everybody forgets that. So. <laughs> it, it needs to be. Good thing he's pretty. Okay. It was but, fun though. But that so was fun. that. Thank you for watching What's in My Porn Bag, and I hope you guys enjoyed that.
and we will see you next time on Porn Education. Bye, guys.